Hey guys, it is Sierra Exantis, author, singer, motivator, woman of many extraordinary things, and founder of Woman of War 365. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Ah, that's my soul. Woo! Hey, hey, I love my life. I love my life. We don't know what tomorrow might bring or the future. Cause I was away. Ah, ay, ay, ay. <laughs> I love that song. Oh, 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 I'm a little bit too fast. <laughs> oh, oh, I love my life. <laughs> oh, I love that song. I love that song. And that is what our topic is for the week is how to love your life, giving up and giving in. And I know you're probably wondering, like, what do you mean giving up? Giving in? What, what you talking about? Well, I'm going to let you know. All right. One of the ways that, well, first of all, if you know me, you know I'm pretty consistently happy, okay? Doesn't mean my life is perfect because it's not. It's way, oh, Lord, if only you knew. It is far, 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 far from perfect. But I do pretty much have consistently good days. And I have formulated this strategy for myself, which I'm about to, you about to get some confidential information, okay? Some good info here. I formulated this strategy for myself to help ensure that I love my life, okay? And it's called giving up and giving in. And I, of course, you know I'm working with a list. I got some list of things that you can probably give up to love your life more. And I got a list of some things that you can probably give in to love yourself more. And I'm gonna give you that away. I'm gonna give that away for, to you this week, just as my service to you, my service to humanity, because I believe that life is so much better when everybody enjoying themselves. Ow, ow. And I'm going to enjoy me, honey. So I hope you're going to enjoy you too. Anyway. <laughs> so, okay. The first thing is give up comparing yourself to others. Okay. You were created unique and you are indiv you're an individual. Blah, blah, blah. You're an, you are an individual and you were created very uniquely and specifically as God wanted you to be. He did not intend for you to be like anybody else. So give up trying to be like anybody else or comparing yourself to other people. It's really pointless, okay? Love you as you are. Um, give up complaining. What good is complaining going to do for you? It's not going to do you any good to be around here complaining. All it's going to do is make you feel even worse about that which you are complaining about. Give it up. Give up trying to be perfect. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Jesus, help you, girl, over here. I am a work in progress with that one, okay? I am a perfectionist, and I like for things to go boom, boom, boom. And one of the things I am actually proud of myself for is allowing myself to just be a little bit more and not trying to be so perfect, have everything so in line. It, it ain't always going to be that way. Not to say you shouldn't strive for excellence because you should, but understand that there is only one who is supreme and perfect, and that is God, and you are not him. I am not him. We are not him. So give it up. Go ahead and embrace that perfect imperfection. Um, also, give up people pleasing. Okay? You are, not put, you are not put on this earth to please everybody. Understand that. Not everybody's going to like you. Not everybody's going to enjoy your company. Not everybody's going to, you know, sing, you know, rah-rah you and expect that, you know, the goodness that you have to bring is going to benefit them. Some people, you just can't please them. And not everybody recognizes goodness when they see it, honey. So it all it ain't always just you, okay? So give up people pleasing, okay? You're amazing as you are. You, don't have to, you ain't got to try to please nobody. Um, also, give up procrastination. Oh, Lord, Jesus, help, help the world, Lord. Help the world with that procrastination. It is like one of the hugest killers to a dream procrastinate and wait. Oh, I'm just going to wait to just have everything. You know, it ain't got to be perfect. Just go on there to do it. Quit procrastinating on it. You already know what it is. Just do it. Um, give up negativity and negative people. Anything negative got to go. It got to go. All right. Go pull up the U-Haul. Um, the Take it somewhere else. 
you know, we ain't even pull up the U-Haul. You know, when that when the dumpster, the, uh, the garbage truck man comes, dump it, honey. Dump it. All right. <laughs> Uh, also, give in to positive people. Anybody that's positive, showing you love, give it to them. Their energy transfers. That's amazing energy that you can use to help, you know, improve your own positivity. Also, give in to progressive relationships. When you see a relationship progressing, give into it. Allow it to just, you know, flourish into something amazing. Uh, give in to your purpose and your passion and your calling. Whatever it is that's tugging on your heart to get done, do it. Give in to it. Also, give in to accepting and loving yourself as you are. Give in to caring for yourself. Self-care is totally important. Okay? Love on you. Mm-hmm. I love you, boo. Yes, I love you. Uh, also, give in to laughter and enjoying yourself. You deserve to laugh. You and you deserve to enjoy yourself. Okay? So, Remember, for this week, how to really enjoy your life is to give up certain things and to give into others. Okay? All right. I will talk to you later. Hopefully, you're having a wonderful day. And hopefully, this week has gotten off to an amazing start. Take care. Bye.